Hey everyone, Sean from Edvo Sean. Uh, here we're going to talk about uh, sending a report when a duplicate submission is made. Uh, someone in the forum had asked uh, if there was a way to check uh, for duplicates in the spreadsheet uh, as, this, as the form is being filled up. So um, what we have here is a script that uh, when a form is submitted, it uh, goes to the spreadsheet, it finds the duplicates, and then it uh, sends you an email report of uh, duplicate entries. Okay, and um, what this email looks like in the end is uh, actually kind of a formatted table with uh, the timestamp, the question, or the form items, and then also the uh, email that uh, the person submitted. Now this uses the email address of the submission, which the user fills out as the as uh, the comparison. That's how I can tell if it's a duplicate or not. And in this case, um, uh, we're just using this uh, easy form right here, just a few items. And here's your email one. Now, as a uh, way to make this script a bit more versatile, we can actually change um, what uh, if you want to put your email down a bit further, we can change uh, where the script looks for it. And I'll show that to you in a minute. But first of all, we have to install the script. So the first thing uh, to do is to copy the script from here. Also, uh, up above, you can make a copy of the spreadsheet itself, uh, in the form itself, if you'd like to. And I'm going to come over here and paste. Just so make sure you set up the triggers if you copy the form because it doesn't do it automatically. So uh, we got our code in here. So we'll firstly, save it. Set up our triggers. So on form submit, that's our controller function uh, from form. And then on form submission, we want to execute that. So save it. Now we'll go back and uh, refresh the form here. and you'll see the settings option here. Now the first thing we got is authorize. Um, when you, before you can run a script, you have to authorize it. This just pretty much sends you an email which triggers the authorization uh, mechanism in Google. So you can authorize real easy without trying to click around in the script. Um, here, set email option. Uh, you can actually uh, set here where you want to receive the report, so just put your email in there. And here under um, set email position is uh, where you identify where on the form that uh, the person filling out the form is putting their email. So in our case it's going to be position 2 because form elements start at 0, so 0 one, two. So you just pop that in there like that, yep. And um, that's pretty much it. Now, uh, when since we set up the trigger, it'll go through, it'll scan uh, what email addresses uh, already exist, and pick up all the ones uh, that are duplicates, and then send you a mail uh, in a table format like this. So I hope you uh, guys find that useful. Uh, if you get a chance, I'd appreciate it if you could uh, stop by my Facebook page here, Shumways Fiverr Gigs. Give me a like or just say hello. Also, um, visit me on Fiverr at uh, Shumway21. Uh, if you like the script but have uh, are having some issues or just don't want to install it yourself, um, you can uh, hire me on this gig here. I'll install anything from my blog uh, for five bucks. So, thanks for watching. See you in the next video.